Astros, huh? Jeez. You know, I, I'm very serious when I say this is this is insanity. This is like saying, you know, more people in Matt Groveland have red brick garden walls than people in Payne Phelan. Right. That have they have painted brick. Well, and we know that's not classy. Where where are we going with this? Well, when I lived in Minneapolis, the, the people responsible for it was the tree department, not to sound like Roycey. Call the tree department. But they department. literally have a tree department that goes around the parks planting trees, and then they plant the trees in the boulevard, and they also take the d- disease trees down. Beyond that, it's up to the homeowners, the landowners, well, to of course tr- put a tree in the ground. So they can only blame themselves. You know, St. Paul can only blame themselves for not planting trees on the stupid boulevard or giving them away to homeowners. But if equity, well, we'll save it for the year. Save but, it. But basically, if if equity is the key component in this, then then you have to have the homes in Highland Park also available to the homes in the in the uh, what do you Rice mean? Street here. Well, no one should that. have a home better than anyone else. Oh, right, right, right. But I don't want to live in a big mini mansion. I, I like my old 1917 farmhouse. <laughs> well, I don't blame you a bit. You up there on Maine? Tree canopy. Oh, the jump is delicious, yeah. Joe. Yeah. Tree canopy priority areas. <laughs> 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 oh, wow. What has happened to the country? It's, it's literally like saying... Cars in Highland Park are washed more frequently than cars in Rice Street neighborhood. Okay, did you see who wrote the piece? Why are we doing the show? Somebody named uh, <laughs> Chloe Johnson and Zoe Jackson. Chloe. Chloe and Zoe. Covers climate and other environmental issues for the Star Tribune. She's a core member with Report for America, a program that places journalists into local newsrooms. So all she's doing here is earning her keep. Yep. And and do we really even need to react to it? Well, I guess we do have to push back. Can I have the ads, please? You, sir. You know, I have a feeling that Tom <laughs> and Giselle will have options. Joe, Joe, the caption for the front for the front pictures on the front page. Yeah. You just can't unsee it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm so horrified. <laughs> like, like we're watching uh, somebody being executed right. on, on the streets right. of Hanoi. You just can't or unsee something. this. Yeah, I'll never unsee that Some execution. Some poor unclothed in Vietnamese girl of flame. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jesus. Wow. Frat and gator. That's it? That's it. Wow, is that good? Now I'm going to go take a leak and we'll start the show. I have. Uh, <laughs> oh. Such, wait. Yeah. Look at look at the monitor. Yep. Last post it. I went through another Oh, you need some. Oh, you yes. need some. Means yes. you're We're on the same page, man. My my dashboard's covered in post-it notes. That means Kenny's coming to the office pretty well, soon. Well, I don't have an office. My office is wherever I am, so I need post-it notes. I've got a uh I've got a nice big back stock, Chris. Okay. One of the greatest I, I, Christmas I was gifts. at the office recently. Oh, yeah, that's right. You're One of the greatest kiss, Christmas gifts I got from the little kids was a big pack of multicolored post-it notes. Yeah. My, uh, my favorite are that's these the kind little of shit post-it notes. You stuff. have such a sad existence. I don't need a Ferrari. <laughs> that and <laughs> socks. Warm socks. Mm-hmm. That's all you I asked for. Note, mini notebooks. Legal pads. The I have some of those legal too. Pads is this what I have to favorites. look forward to? I have some of those, John. Yeah, it is. Huh. Look, I still have a note from Kenny on this one. Human I, composting. I oh, we forgot to do that story. Well, I still got it somewhere. 